Hi everyone. I thought with that hot weather that we had last week that we should do a popsicle. I love having popsicles when it's hot out. I have my piece of paper, my pencil for my writing, my black for my outline, and I'm going to draw an orange popsicle today. Our first step is to put our name in the top left hand corner. All right, to start my popsicle, I'm going to draw a straight line, but then it starts to curve at the top. Curves all the way around, comes back down to a straight line to the other side, just like that. The bottom of the popsicle, I'll close off with a line straight across. Now we need to add the popsicle stick. It's two straight lines down, the size that a popsicle stick would be on a real popsicle. And then I curve a line to join them together. My popsicle's been outside in the heat, so it's starting to drip a little bit. So I'm gonna start from here. I'm going to draw some drips. You just curve your lines in. You can make your drips however you like though. When I go to color in my popsicle, the bottom half is going to be lighter than the top half because the top half will be melting a little bit. Before I can color in my popsicle, I need to stretch out the word and write the sounds that I hear. P, P, popsicle. P, P, O, O, O. Pop, P, P. Another P. Pop s, s. Now we can't hear the I, so we'll write an I. S -k -k. The K sound in popsicle is a C. Popsicle, -ol. an L. And then there's an E on the end that we can't hear. Just like that. I grabbed a brown as well so that I can lightly color in my popsicle stick, taking my time. They are typically a light brown or a tan color. Now for the top half of my popsicle, I'm going to press a little bit harder on my crayon. This is the part of my popsicle that is melting. When I'm pressing hard, I'm still taking my time to stay in the lines. So it's not a race. What is your favorite flavor of popsicle? Taking my time. A good tip while you're trying to stay in the lines is to color right beside it, one line, and then you can move to the other parts and start coloring them in. All right, so I used a lot of pressure on the top half. Now I'm going to switch and only use a little bit of pressure. Nice and light for the bottom. The bottom half hasn't started to melt yet. There we go. I can't wait to see the work that you've done. Have you got to enjoy a popsicle outside yet? 